and welcome to Retro Roulette. Get the door, it's Domino's. I'm your host, Michael Riley. With me is Dane Fortune. Hey. And Jason Amherst. Beepong. Woo! All right, it's time for... <laughs> it's time for... <laughs> I don't know what the hell okay. What in the hell? Uh, this is the... Uh, we're doing N64 games, as you could no doubt tell by the fact that those are N64 games on this wheel that you're seeing on your screen, you on your YouTube video screen right now. Let's do this. Turning into old Ric Flair. These, These are, are the N64 games. games on the wheel. Woo! Right now. Today, <laughs> we're going to play my favorite thing to make a woman. <laughs> Wet tricks. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> and it's an ocean game too. Yep. Oh. oh god. Oh. <laughs> you know, you not, you you may not believe me, but as soon as you said that, I was like, he's gonna say Wetrix, isn't he? Because <laughs> I remember it's like, oh, that is an N sixty four game. I remember. Yeah. It's been on the wheel for like a hot minute too. I, uh, what do we do here? Oh, options first, of course. Uh huh. Score codes. Yeah, I'm, I'm good with all that. What does that mean? I don't fucking know. Oh, if I know. <laughs> so as we record this, it is the 9th of April. Uh, last night, my dad and I went to the Count Basie Theater in New Jersey, and we went oh. to see I was Steve Vai about this. We went to see Steve Vai and Joe Satriani. Oh, nice. And in the words of Carl from Happy the Hunger Force, they kicked ass. They kicked so much ass. <clears throat> yeah, they kicked so much ass. I don't know if this is um, bullshit. You, uh, you're supposed to make lakes or padels I, or yeah, something? Yeah, I, like I'm aware. So. In amongst the audience members was a older black gentleman who said of Joe Satriani, and I quote, God damn, that Mr. Clean looking motherfucker sure knows how to play a motherfucking guitar. <laughs> God damn your <laughs> righteousness. His hand. Also, he was talking on the phone with what I assume was his wife or girlfriend, talking about, man, shut up with you and your Hershey kiss nip nips. What? Wow. The fuck? You think? Do you think I know? Do you think I know? Yes, that's why I asked. No, no need the fuck. No need the fuck. Oh Lord, have mercy. Kiss lips. <laughs> <laughs> yep, CJ gets it. He gets it. Uh, I think Dane missed the fact that I entered Kiss Nips as the name, and that's why Jason said that. <laughs> I was, it, I was in on the joke, you fucking idiot. I know what you. I play. was in on the idiot, you fucking joke. <laughs> I, you're well. <laughs> hey, you said it, not me. Correct. Erect. That is what I am 24 7, even though I'm 97 years old. Woo! <laughs> Woo! 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 Uh, <laughs> let me tell you all a story about an about ugly lady. She was sleeping with three very ugly girls. Woo! They all had it. pussy hair of gold. I came up. Uh, 
youngest one, Hager. This is this is so horrible. Why am I even saying this? I, I don't know. What you know? Game? I'm, I'm still trying there. to figure out this game. And wow, just yeesh. You know, I have to be honest with you. Even though I've heard of this game, I am actually kind of unclear about what exactly it is you're supposed to do. I think you're just supposed to like, make lakes. But I'll be goddamned man, if I know. Supposed to do nine lakes? Nine? Nine? So, so you're supposed to build up the ground around the areas. And, oh, I see. So you get things that raise the ground and lower things the Things that lower it. Hmm. Okay, and then every so often you get water. And when you drop the water, okay. Then you lose. I guess. Well, like, so, so when you drop the water, the water fills in those holes that you've been filling. Hmm. I have no idea what the hell oh the voice God, is saying. Oh my God, this game is so annoying. Just like, I think it's what? saying three lakes right now. Oh, it's saying how many lakes I have formed? Um, yeah. Um, why does that have to feel Passion the need to say it a hundred times? <laughs> three lakes. I don't three know. lakes. Three. Listen, there's one more thing I gotta ask you. <laughs> yeah, Lieutenant Colombo is... A, uh, you, you know, it's, it's the silliest thing, but... uh. Could have sworn we said three legs, but it was actually four legs. Some I got. Three eggs. Three eggs. Oh, I can rotate them. I didn't know I could do that. So, WrestleMania 40. Oh. WrestleMania 40 has come and gone. Yes. Yes, it has. And finally, finally, the Cody Rock Rhodes has left the building. No, it's okay. Not even that. Finally, Cody Rhodes has finished his story. That's right, Rhodey Codes. But oh, we are we are not done with Rhodes stories. Oh no, no, no! Because you see, ladies and gentlemen, in AEW, all of a sudden Dustin Rhodes is like, "I'm gonna, I never won a world title like my daddy, so I'm gonna finish my story." I'm the only one left who hasn't done that now because Cody did it. I'm Dustin Rhodes, goddammit. Rhodes, I'm going to challenge Samoa Joe for the world title. It's like, you're not even like, you're not even trying to make it subtle. You're just, you're, you're blatantly copying off of... Cloud Chaser! Game. It's true. I don't want to destroy anything. God dang it. No! Let's go over here, fuck it. That whole what section is? is fucking gone now. How do you know? It really sounds like he's saying, I am gay. Uh, How do you win? <laughs> I you don't know. You, know. Really, you just do a little, you do a little bit better each time. You never really win. I am gay. I am gay. I am gay. It says Alex Jones fucking... <laughs> the frogs are gay. The, the frogs, frogs are gay. gay. Yeah, basically. Hunk him a goofity. Hung the boogly boogly. So I'm very glad to hear that this past Monday night's Raw was not the hijack Raw where. Oh, we're the smart fans. We're going to do silly chants. I mean, hijack. in fairness, why would they hijack it? Mania was good. Mania exactly. was good, and uh, Raw was decent. So. Stand und deliver. Stand und deliver. Three legs. Stand. Seven legs. Fuck legs. Green eggs. Well, you're, no, no, you, you guys don't get it. This show, this video game is sponsored by Frito Lay. 
Free lays. Free lays. <laughs> Tony Khan comes in. Did someone say free cocaine? No, no, Tony. <laughs> I am gay. I am just. It sounds like he's saying I am gay. Arr. Not that there's, not that there's anything wrong with that. No, there's nothing wrong this, with that. This game is absolutely horrible. Yeah, I, I'm not sure I'm I, quite understanding what you, the fuck I'm supposed to be doing. You know, I'm beginning to suspect that this game is not very good. That could be. I don't know. It's just a suspicion of mine. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do, but all right. I get me. Thanks for letting us know. Michael Bay. <laughs> uh, thanks for letting us know, Todd Grisley. I'm, hey, y'all, I'm not gay. Me and my wife are in a committed love and marriage. You know. Stop giving me is down arrows. Down. No, 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 stop giving me down arrows. Hmm. Err. Somebody, uh, I keep getting the, uh, this advertisement on Facebook for, like, the ultimate edition of the Super Mario Brothers movie. 4K. Oh, the, uh, the 4K version? They're putting in a lot of effort to a movie that people really didn't like. Yeah, and yet, like, it's also an arm and a leg because you gotta import it from, like, Australia. Oh, even... even lovelier. Yeah. Meanwhile, I just got, uh, I just got an awesome Blu-ray set. So I got, uh... Kamen Rider Geats. Okay. Yeah, it's uh, last season's Kamen Rider show. Ah. The Happy Birthday. Happy Birthday to you. Uh, it's, uh, too bad, too bad O's hasn't come out yet in the States. Nine lakes, nine lakes. Ricky Lake. Ricky Lake. Ricky Lake. What, if, what about her? I don't know. She's okay, I guess. Seven million legs. A lot of legs. Uh, that was my best You're game best yet. Game yet. Uh huh. Woo! 40 lakes. Uh. Fuck you. <laughs> yes. Precisely. Hey, fuck you is the 100 piece champion, challenger, champion, challenger, champion, challenger. Nice. Whatever. Handicap? This I think playing this game, game is a handicap. This, this, game is handicap Mr. this game is terrible! Stop this game! Use uppers Ooh. to build a wall around the landscape. I beg your pardon. Uh-huh. I mean... So what I need I is some Tony riddle Don out. Uses uppers all the time. Yeah, right. Before the deluge what falls. Get it, murder, fuck, fuck. Did you say baby fuck, fuck? Uh, yeah. And if you have a problem with that, you can take it up. If you have a with problem with that, yo, I'll solve it. Check out the hook while my DJ will well, solve it. DJ ice, ass, ice, baby. ass. Baby. Dun, 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 dun. Ass. To ass. Ass, ass, baby. Ass to ass. 
Is that is that the sequel to Back to Life? S to S. S to S, Charlie. Pretty sure that was uh, a Jared Foyles thing. Oof. Remember when he was on the mental cast? I do. I do. I now pronounce you man and four times the steak. <laughs> four times the steak. Four times the steak. <laughs> All right. Well, I built the perimeter. I don't know what. Oh, is there because there's a hole here? Yeah. So I have a perimeter. I think. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna say I have uh, a perimeter now. now. Boom, 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 boom. Am I just lesson failed? There was a leak. Damn it, Julian Assange! <laughs> what? 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 What did I do? Why? There was a leak. I, I have enough, Listen, I have enough feet going on in my life right now. I do. I have why enough feet. Me? Enough sheet. Sheets. Oh, a sheet, a sheet, a fitted sheet, sheet. a top sheet. That's yes, right. I have, I have many fitted sheets in my life. Why are you bothering? Me? <laughs> oh, me. yeah, you know oh, wait, what? He's Australian. Thoughts. He's, not... <laughs> he's an Australian pretending to be French. Thoughts. That's on, uh, thoughts what I was. I was going for like, going man. for like uh, European or whatever. This I game think, is I think, I think really not very... European. <laughs> this game is really not good. It, it was actually kind of stupid. It was a kind of poopy, farty, smelly. And uh, I didn't like it. No, sir. I didn't like it. Doot, 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 doot. Jason. I'm glad we live in a world now where there is a Tetris company that has taken hold of the Tetris name that other people can't make shitty Tetris knockoffs like Wordtris, Hattris, Sextris, and Wettris. It's funny and you shit say like this. It's funny you say what Wordtris because that's on the SNES roulette wheel. <laughs> yeah. Like no no like I'm glad we live in a world now where we live in a society. There is Yeah. <laughs> no no more shitty Tetris knockoffs. That's why he became the Joker. He played Wetrix for twenty minutes. <laughs> That's why he became the Joker. He found Captain Wakey. I'm tired of being told there was a leak. <laughs> I put so many lakes and so many downers, but they just <laughs> oh, they kept failing me. <laughs> Anyway, uh, yeah, no, this is uh, poopy doopy poopy fart fart jizzy jizzy cum cum. This is uh, jizzy jizzy cum cum. Oh, how boy. do you do? Yeah, this is ass. This is, I, no, actually, I think that's even being polite to ass. I think ass would be is slightly better than this. Um, no, I would never play this again. Not in a million years. Scores out of ten, Dane. One. Jason. Zero. Absolute zero. No doubt about it. All right. Uh, let's get spinning. Dangerous. Let's get I rather, dangerous. I would rather electrocute my. I would rather electrocute my Hershey kiss nip nip. So it's a thing thing. Dark winged up. <laughs> let's get dangerous. Yes, yeah, Dane. Hello, let's get dangerous. Oh, yes. License by Nintendo. No, have you? No, you have to realize something. Oh, no. I'm, oh, I'm oh my again. God. Ocean Y. Ocean Y. Ocean game. Dripping down my thigh. Anyway. A racing game, it's, it's, yeah, it's a racing game by Ocean rather than a puzzle oh, game no. by Ocean. Are we gonna have is this Ocean the, the, the show? I what hope not. This? You do have two vetoes. No, it's, it's a Japanese racing game from uh, Imagineer but licensed by Ocean because that's uh, that's the uh, 
Japanese music label Avex uh, branded on that uh, car. So what I was trying to get at earlier is that I was doing the voice of Winnie the Pooh, and Jim Cummings voices Winnie the Pooh now, and since he voices Darkwing Duck as well, Winnie the Pooh would theoretically be able to say, let's get dangerous, Piglet. Let's get dangerous, you bitch. You see, Michael, Michael, why do you have to make things weird? Why not? I love the clam chowder. Uh, chowder? Chowder? <laughs> Say, Say it right, 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 right G. All it's right, chowder. I'm gonna enjoy this. Around by are you just waiting for the last possible second to see if we'll veto this? Uh, no, I was actually uh, adjusting the wheel to get rid of this game. <laughs> I mean, I was kind of hoping you'd veto it, but of course you're not going to be that kind, so we're going to play this. You, you, are, you know what? Since you're going to be a little beanie baby bitch, fine, veto. Nah, it's too late now. Oh, excuse yeah. me. You gotta do it within the first two minutes. <laughs> it has not been two minutes. It has. I can oh, show it's, you the. I can show you the timer, if you'd like, because I have. A, I time each. You segment. know what? I whatever. Just play the play the goddamn game. All right. What? Easy. All right, let's do it. Oh, one thing's for certain. It's no. <laughs> For the love of God, man! Beethoven, Flabadoo. I had a stroke. Beethoven, Flabadoo. Beethoven. Manitoba. <laughs> yes, that's in Canada. Yeah, it is. Manitoba, <laughs> left noob. <laughs> Uh, hi there, this is Pony Con. Uh, in, uh, in the interest of trying to get new people to watch AEW, I will sniff coke off of Samoa Joe's moves. As I said to you the other day, why would he do that when CJ Perry is there and newly single? I, I just can't believe that we're getting a rerun of WrestleMania so soon, of seeing you know, Rhodes go after a title being held by, by a Samoan, a Samoan named Joe. Yeah. It's true. You know, speaking of speaking of that whole situation. Speaking of that whole I wasn't gonna I wasn't gonna say anything, but ladies and gentlemen, I learned that Mike is very willing to just throw me off the the bus. Throw me under a two and let me get taken by Tony Khan to McDonald's. What? He's buying new food. What's what's the problem? Yeah, but he's gonna he's gonna dump cocaine all over it. That's not all useless. over your food. What are you talking about? Well, oh. You don't know. Well, yes, I do. You you can't just force people to sniff cocaine. Pretty sure that's illegal. Although so is possessing that, it. That's, that's not <laughs> that's not salt on those fries. Listen. <gasps> Nobody's going to force you to do any drugs that you don't want to do. You. But if he's going to snort his own cocaine through his own fries that he's drilled a hole into the center of so that he could use the fries as a cocaine straw, that's his business. It's his business and his business only. That's right. All he's doing is buying you a Happy Meal. With a free mm. Mighty Max toy. That's all. Well, what if I don't want a Mighty Max toy? You want a Polly Pocket instead? Yes. All right. Well, then it's a Polly Pocket toy. What do you want? Uh, I'm, I want you to say it right, you boopy face to me. It right. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, I, don't, I don't ask for much. I'm glad I could have got a time to date you. You're glad you could Tamagotchi me? Yeah, that's right. Okay. I'm glad I could carry you around as like a digital pet. 
and my, then forget to feed you and yeah, and then and then you just you. and then you just die randomly one day. And then and then your parents go, yeah. well, you, so why, would, day, why should we get you a dog if you if you let your Tamagotchi die? One day you come home from school and you find out your Tamagotchi died. That really happened to me, actually. <laughs> I had a Tamagotchi. I came home from school one day and it was just dead, and I'm just like, oh no. <laughs> And then I threw it in the we, drawer and forgot about it promptly. Were you that? Were you that one? Oh no! It I threw it. In, I threw it. Oh no! Child. Yeah, I threw it in the drawer right next to my Furby. Not the Furby. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, one of my uh, friends uh, shook a Furby to death. You can do that. So, there was a sensor inside of it that, like, when you picked up the Furby, it was supposed to go, Wee! Again! So, like, he started shaking the thing to try to make it go wee again and again and again. And it just got broken. And it was like, eh, eh, eh. <laughs> So what you're saying so what is you're... He, gave the, he gave the thing sits. Yeah. Yeah, shaken Furby syndrome. Yeah, sudden Furby death syndrome. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, Sibud strikes again. Woods. How terrible. Yeah. I'm a Furby, and I don't like you. I, I'm a Furby, and I'm going to kill you. Wait, what was that? Round one, I mean, you're yay. short. That said, round one, you're short. Hmm. Well, I guess it depends upon what you consider short. Uh, two inches. Hmm. From the floor! The from the ground. Bang dong, hammer, no, ha, 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 been a whole lot easier since the bitch left town. <laughs> been a whole lot easier since the mother left town. <laughs> it's been a whole lot easier since the boop pop beep. <laughs> been a whole lot easier since the motherfucker left town. <laughs> I've been snorting that coke. Now can't you tell? <laughs> um... I think, I think Chris Barron, the lead, the lead singer, singer of the Spin Doctors, Doctor. <laughs> needs to go. He needs to go home now. I took off my pants, and boy, did it smell. Anyway, huh? Been a whole lot easier since you went to heaven. Jesus, out of hell, <laughs> motherfucker! You just did not. God laugh. damn it! I fucking knew that was coming. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, screw it. The Jewish people don't deserve this. They're going through enough right now. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Okay, fine. Well, well, let's do something different. Unskinny Bubba. No need of fuck. No need of fuck. Oh, night and day. Oh, this is a this happened several months back. Which fucking we hairband does that song? Is that Warrant? Poison. 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 I don't fucking know. There are, the, half of them are the same fucking people. I, I did, feel something. Uh, we did a running joke where we had a Japanese businessman doing karaoke yeah. to that. Song. Oh, I re I remember. I was there. It was on this show. Unskinny <laughs> bumpin' up. Oh, Have we really come that far that we're finally starting to reference things that happened on this version of this show? <laughs> Has it been that long now? 
It must be. I mean, this iteration of the show has been on for about a year. Uh, a little over a year, yeah. About a year and a half, actually, almost. Because we started January of 2023. Oh, the skinny bubble. We started on the anniversary, on the 10th anniversary of You Can't Be Serious. A show that is technically still in production. True. Because I still have episodes I haven't. I just haven't had time to get to or around to editing them. I'm sure at some point I will. Tr- I will at least get around to editing some. <clears throat> Unskinny bopperoo. Unskinny fuckaroo. None of. I I still want to see Mike play. Uh... She's only One of the seventeen. I love Rory's. <laughs> oh my god! You're listen. I was a Japanese businessman, okay? <laughs> yeah. And technically, yeah. seventeen really isn't that that young in Japan, considering the age of consent. Uh, I'd like to hear what. Like, yeah. I'd like to hear what James Pluck did to say before you started getting. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, Mike playing through one of the Yakuza games would be funny, especially just jumping into one of the ones in the middle with no uh, context no of context. the uh, storyline. What's this? What's this? Uh, none of the fuck is going on in this game. Uh, I have often... was like, you know? "Hey, I'm coming back, guys." <laughs> Hey guys, what I mean? So, uh, Mark with uh, Mark with the Yakuza explainers. Yeah, I, I kind of feel like I would need Mark Gladhill if I was starting to play. If I was going to play Yakuza, he was a, <laughs> he's a walking. He would be a walkthrough. For you. Yeah, yeah, almost literally. Kind of like how well, I you was could just play the uh, Fist of the North Star uh, spinoff because that's a one-off game. True. All right, thoughts on uh, whatever the fuck this game was called? I forget. GT sixty four. GT sixty four. It was just a generic racing game. It was kind of boring. <laughs> it's no Daytona. It's no Daytona. <laughs> blah blah blah. It's no cruising. That's for sure. It's true. This game was just. There. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Jason. Yeah, I mean, uh, just play cruising. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> and I think there's actually a, uh, I do believe there's actually a cruising game on the wheel. <laughs> it's uh, the, the last the game, game, Exotica. Uh, no, because there's uh, we still haven't done. I don't believe we've done Cruising World yet. I believe Cruising World. I think you did world. world. You did USA, and I think you've done it's World. World okay, then Cruising Exotic. Well, it's not on the wheel. Then I thought it was still. Maybe we did it like an episode two ago, and I forgot. <laughs> I've got a lot of episodes in the can, right? Okay, <laughs> we got still stuff that's got to air. Uh, yeah, this is just a boring ass racing game. Nothing really special about it. Scores out of ten, Dane. Two. Jason. Two. I'm going to give it a one. All right. Uh, so in the in the interim there, while we were playing the second game, you might have noticed there's a couple extra things on the wheel now. Uh, d- uh, there's a Mike's Choice, Dane's Choice, and Jason's Choice on the wheel. So if it lands on one of those, they get to choose what game from the wheel and I'll I'll provide you a list once if if that should happen. This this is a concept I was toying around with for a bit and I decided to go ahead and just uh enact it mid episode. <laughs> so, uh yeah. Those are the so, wheels. Ca- cast just... choice cast choice wheel. Uh cast choice spaces are on the wheel. So, we could land on one of those. Let's spin it. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, dear. 
Tailspin. Audio. <laughs> Is the chorus all right? What's going on here? Audio. I, I have a bolster. Friends were life too thick and thin with another tails of in the room. What the, the fuck is this? K A R S cars for kids? Oh. Never mind. This Rakuga is... kids? Yeah. Um. Why does this sound so familiar? We played it on MVG Live back in the day. Oh, okay. it, was a, it was a one-off that we played in the very early days of MVG Live. And uh, it's notable because it did not come out in America. Yep, uh, basically yeah. just means doodle kids. Yeah, it, um. only, it only came out in the Europe and in the Japan. And that's it. <laughs> in the Europe and in the Japan. That's, that is correct. That's what I say. That's what I said. Da, 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 D. So apparently the uh, characters were drawn by different people. Like they had guest artists. Really? All right. Uh, I hit random, so. Captain Cat Kit was drawn by DDJ. Um, and the hidden characters Inuzo was drawn by Mudgas. And Darkness was drawn by George, the boss character. Darkness George. was drawn by George. George. Yeah. <laughs> A ghost Did, you say, with mud, did you say mud gas? Mud gas. Muddy. Mud gas or mm. it's muddy. Uh, muddy. Mamezo was drawn by Val. Un unless these are the names of characters, I guess, maybe? Yeah, I guess they're the name of characters. It's like astronauts drawn by Andy. Yes. Okay, never mind. Yeah. The actual artists. Oh yeah, I remember. I remember the game. And Megumi Wakayama. Okay. Uh, one notable composer, Kozo Nakamura, uh, was a member of the Konami Kukeha Club. Uh, worked on uh, DDR, Supernova, and Guitar Freaks. Uh, TMNT 2, the arcade game. Uh, and the Manhattan Project, um, and Monster in My Pocket. We'll get it out of there. I got a Monster in My Pocket. My chill. Let's see, uh, Shigeharu Umezaki went on to, uh, oh, uh, they worked on, uh, The Legend of the Mystical Ninja series. Uh, currently okay. leading Good Feel Company. It's a company that just put out, uh, uh, they just put out the, uh, uh, Princess Peach Showtime game, but he was the senior producer of Yoshi's Woolly World. Okay. Uh, um, that was the most recent game that he worked on. <laughs> Good feel. Oh yeah, Garfield. Oh yeah, Garfield. I hate Monday yeah, yeah. Night. <laughs> yeah, I can see why this thing comes stateside because the idea that like, oh, 3D games are the new cool. Let's not release anything that's a 2D game. Unfortunately. <laughs> Nowadays, like, 2D games are in vogue because, you know, it's retro. Everything that's old is new again. That's Margaret mm -hmm. Cho. <laughs> Robot I Cho. Said I said vintage, not an abortion. Oh. Yeah. Ready, two, <laughs> Margaret Shaw.
Boop -a -boop -a -boop -a -boop -a -boop this game is a freaking acid trip. It is. I think it was. <laughs> we felt the same way back when we played it 12 years ago. <laughs> yes, indeedy. You electrocuted me, you some bitch. Hey, this is a children's game. Hey, this is a game. Cho? Stop it. Get some dip. <laughs> Little girly combo. Little girly combo. Hey, oh. Oh. The difference is me. The do the the da 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 da. This all I want to say to you. <laughs> How do you use one of your specials? That's what I want to know. Must be L or R. Aha! See ya. See ya. R. Yeah, I don't know why he said his letters say car every once in a while. I don't. Or Cho. Because he's got wheels. Well, Cho, because he's the Cho, robot. He's a Cho. regular robot. Okay, that makes sense. But then sense. they're like ABC sometimes. Listen here, you fuck doing, nut. Doing. Stop cursing in front of the, the bear. Why? Because it's not nice. You're not nice. Bobby. I'm nice. I'm, I'm perfectly nice, you fucking jerk. That was a gun. In a kid's game. Oh. That yeah. robot's packing heat. I mean, remember, in Digimon, there is literally a puppet with a gun. Puppet's got a gun. <laughs> puppet's got a gun. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure it was just Puppetmon, and he carried, like, a freaking revolver. Dane's so long things in revolver. the sun. That's when I reach for my revolver. Wow, he got me. Just barely. A matter of pixels. He cut, he cut you good, bitch. <laughs> you oh, lose. Hmm. Do, 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 There's nothing I like more than watching a stuffed bear and a robot that's his car brawling in front of a school bus. What says Cho, car, gun? Slumpty. No, it's, it's got to be a three-letter word. Ass. <laughs> Turns into an ass sometimes. Hit. P. <laughs> Jizz if you leave off a Z. <laughs> Jize, I guess. Jize? Yeah. I don't know. That's the under Jize, that's the underside of an elephant's gooch. <laughs> Ew. Yeah. That's that's a little that's a little gross. It is. Okay, oh, you win. Oh, you win. You are Curdy Vindaloo. I'm tired. This is too boring. Is that a comment on the game cool. as a whole? <laughs> this game isn't terrible. Just. Not it's, very, it's a standard. Not yeah, it's just, it's just a standard fighting game. I mean, it just could have been any character. I mean, it could be worse. 
Could be could raining. Could be dark rift. Could be raining. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it could be dark rift. Oh. Damn it. Who said that? You're fighting today is the giant clitoris monster. Excuse me one moment. She had a chicken on her she's got a chicken on her head. This this character's got a chicken. Chicken head. Chicken head. Chicken head. She used, to, she used to be in a musical uh, duo act with Buckethead. Because <laughs> since we all know that uh, oh. Buckethead wears a chicken bucket on his head. Chicken bucket, yeah. Oh, uh, how about uh, that time uh, Buckethead uh, formed a duo with uh, Les Claypool? Primus, uh, yeah. See, that really happened. Yeah. <laughs> it's a, it's a, I was. Yeah, but I was, the actual I was name making... of the album. The actual name of the album was Colonel Claypool and his bucket of Bernie brains. That's a very Primus name. Yeah. Colonel Colonel Cockmongrel. Buckethead is released like. 700,000 albums, right? Something like that, approximately. Yeah. Dude just God doesn't know when to stop. Me. Uh in fairness though, if I could play guitar half as good as Buckethead, I would probably have a sizable output of music myself. Yeah, can we get a, can we get a, can we get a picture of Buckethead? Sure. Yeah. Here he is. Look at that man. Mm. Yeah, you don't even really know what he looks like because he also wears a mask, like... but. I wonder well, if his name is Brian Patrick Carroll or uh, The Unknown. It's The Unknown. He also provided music for uh, the for for Sigil, the first uh, DLC produced by John Romero for Doom in uh, years. It came out a few years ago. He did not produce the music he for would. Central 2, though, unfortunately. Strangely enough. Evil both... Chocolatier who lives in the walls. Yeah, I, I, I watch all of Civi's videos, Civi 11's videos, and I'm just like, there's so many Doom, like, add-ons that I've never played. I've never played Sigil or Sigil 2. I've never played No Rest for the Wicked. Ain't no rest for the wicker. You need to give that uh, Wario Landish one a uh, shot. Well, I'm talking about officially released, like. Oh yeah, Doom yeah. Mods. Sigil and Sigil Two are both made by John Romero. That rest for the record was made by Nerve Software. <laughs> Captain Cat Cat. Captain Cat Cat, cat Kit Coot Cot Coot Key Cat Cut. Rumble. Captain Coot. Captain Coot. Captain Here I am facing not Parappa the Rapper. Punch. This would have been so much better. It would have it would have been better as a Parappa the Rapper fighting game. Oh my god, that would have been nuts. And that's really the art style is very indicative of that. It, it, it reminds me a lot of Parappa the Rapper. Can you imagine a Parappa the Rapper fighting game with Parappa and Master Onion and fucking Umjammer Lammy? I, I, I would want to I would want to play the entire game as Chop Chop Master Onion. There you go. Uh, I, I'd want to play as uh, Burger Meister Meister Burger. <laughs> or whatever the hell the burger guy was. Burger Meister Meister Burger was in that, uh, you had a Santa Claus or something, or? Oh, Santa maybe. Claus? Whatever the burger guy was in the uh, second Parappa game. Hmm. The, the ghost burger guy. <laughs> Cook <laughs> those burgers! <laughs> Turn the party over! Turn the party over! Um... Wow. 
the Beard Burger Master, the founder of Beard Burgers. Oh, okay. Beard Burger Master. You gotta do what? You gotta do what? I gotta pee. Thanks, Jowski. Oh, Although, uh, that... the flea market uh, guy was also really good. The Gotta Go Pee song actually has to be slightly rewritten since Jowski transitioned. <laughs> gotta go pee. I mean, it can, still run, it, can, it can still run down Jasky's leg, but I gotta change some of the pronouns and wordings. <laughs> it's not accurate. Technically, technically, dead names are now, so I don't want to. I, I feel like I should rewrite that song and re record it 12 years later. <laughs> Just out of nowhere, that happens. Yeah, that's, that's not in safety. I might just do it All on you ever Monday. need is to be nice and friendly. They call me Mr. Bombastic. Mr. Lover, Lover. Mr. Lover. <laughs> oh, that was, that was the, uh, that was the uh, freaking uh, flea market lizard guy. I want to show my nurse son. <laughs> my appreciation. <laughs> Attack the fire nurse son. I want to be in the nurse son. All domination. We're Jason Sunson, did that impersonation. <laughs> you fucking goddamn it! <laughs> That's my joke. I'll kill you. Yeah! Fair. Oh, it's a meter match. It's too bad that we are out of time. Fair match. Thoughts on Rakuga Kids, Dane. It was in, it, it's kind of, it's cute. It's it's inventive. I'm not gonna say it's the best fighting game I've ever seen, but it's definitely not the worst fighting game. It was very cutesy, very interesting. I liked it. I liked it. Baby, I like it. Uh, Jason. Yeah, I enjoyed uh, Doodle Brats. Doodle Brats. Doodle Brats. Doodle uh, brats. That's what I think they would have called it in the United States. Doodle brats. Doodle brats. That is a distinct possibility. Uh, yeah, it's it's just a standard fighting game. Like these could have been any characters, and honestly, like I said, I I mean it's the wrong system for that. But it would have been a better as a Parappa the Rapper fighting game. Um, of course, that would have been on PS One, not anything else. Um, in any mm -hmm. event, uh, thank you. Uh, oh, uh, the scores out of ten, Dane. I was going to outro seven. Well. Uh, Jason. Uh, six. I'll go seven. On this is the uh, edition of the show, we played Wet Tricks, GT sixty four, and Rakuga Kids. What's the best game of the episode, Dane? Rakuga Kids. Jason. Rakuga Kids. Yeah, I, I, I agree. Rakuga Kids is the winner. Thanks for joining us for this edition of Retro Roulette. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe. Be sure to hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane Ford, Jonah, Jason Amherst, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time on Retro Roulette. <laughs>